out. In this video, we're going to look at Read Receipts in the Messages app. With Read Receipts, what we're able to do is notify other people, or the Messages app will notify other people when we've read their messages. What we can do is we can turn this on and off globally for all conversations or for individual conversations. We're going to look at this on the Mac, iPad, and iPhone. Let's first look at this on my Mac. Now let's first discuss what read receipts are. When I send a message, let's go ahead and send a message. I'm gonna send a message to my personal account here. I'm just going to send a photo. We'll just select a photo here. And I've sent that to my personal account. Now if we look here, you're going to see down towards the bottom, it says it was delivered. So I haven't read yet. This is what a read receipt is. It was delivered but I haven't read it yet. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to read this. I'm gonna open this up on my personal device. When I do that, watch what happens. This delivered here is going to change to read and it's gonna give me the date that it was read or the time that it was read. So I'm going to read this here, my personal device, and then you're going to see it says it was read. So with read receipts, what we're able to do is see when someone read a message that we sent. Now, if you want to turn that off, if you do not want to let people know when you've read their messages, what we can do is we can turn that off globally or we can turn it on and off for individual conversations. As an example, what I do is I have read receipts turned off globally. So by default, it is not on any conversations that I create or that I'm in. But I do have it turned on for a couple of individual people. So how do we set this up? How do we turn it on and off globally, so then people will not be able to see when I've read a message, or turn it on and off for individual conversations. Well, on the Mac, to turn it on and off globally, what we do is we go over to our Messages Preferences. So I go up to Messages here in the menu bar, and then we go over to Preferences. We have a new window that opens up, and you're going to see iMessage at the top. This is where we need to be, this tab. Down towards the bottom, you're going to see Send Read Receipts. When this is turned on, what will happen is people are going to be notified when you read their messages. So I have this on. If Beth were to send me a message and I read that message, she would be able to see when I read that. If I want to turn that off for all conversations, even new conversations, what I do is I just deselect this. And now it is going to be turned off. I can create a new conversation. Read receipts will not be on that conversation. Now, what about individual? I'm going to turn this back on. What about individual conversations? Maybe what you'd like to do is have it on and off for individual people. Well, all you have to do for individual conversations is go over to the conversation. So I'm going to go to this conversation here. And let's turn it off for this conversation. So it's going to be on for everyone else. Remember, I turned it back on globally, but I want it turned off for this conversation. Well, all you have to do is just select it. And then we go over to the I in the upper right hand corner. And when you click on this, what you're able to do down towards the bottom is turn on and off send read receipts. So if I turn this off, what's going to happen now is all of my other conversations is going to send read receipts, even new ones, but for this individual conversation, it is not going to send read receipts. Again, I actually have it flipped on my personal account. I have it turned off for all conversations, but then I can go into individual conversations and then turn it on. So how do we do this with the iPad and iPhone? Well, let's go over to my iPad first. And to turn this on and off globally, what we need to do is go over to our settings app. Again, you're going to see I have read receipts here. So I'll go over to my settings app. I just swipe up and we go over to my settings. From here, what I need to do is go over to messages. This is where I find my messages settings. Over on the right, what we have here is send read receipts. All I have to do is just turn this off and it'll turn off read receipts. It will not send read receipts. It will not notify people when I've read their messages for all conversations, even new ones. If you want to do this individually, we go back into the Messages app, just like with the Mac. We select our conversation, 
And then what we do is we go over to the name here. I click on it. And then you're going to see Send Read Receipts. What I'm able to do is turn this on and off individually for each conversation. On the iPhone, it basically works the same way. Let's go over to my iPhone. You're going to see I do have red down at the bottom, so this has Read Receipts turned on. To turn it on and off globally, I go to my Settings app. We go over to Messages. And then you're going to see Send Read Receipts. From here, I can turn this on and off globally. It's going to apply to all conversations, including new conversations. To turn it on and off individually, we go back over to our Messages app, and then we go over to our conversation. So I'm going to go to Dan here. I tap on Dan at the very top. This is where you can see all the settings for that particular conversation. And again, you're going to see I have Send Read Receipts. And what I'm able to do is turn it on and off individually for that conversation. So that's how we manage our read receipts for the Messages app on the Mac, iPad, and iPhone.